And welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy VIII. It's Strife and Lee here again, and we're going to do some sewer stuff. I hate that. Ooh, sewer stinky. Ugh. I hate sewer levels. Uh, the worst sewer level I ever dealt with was Xenogears. Everybody loves that game, and yet I just hated it. I wanted to hey, like I it, will but... I will say, as far as sewers go, this one isn't the worst I've ever seen in a game. No, it's mostly these wheels. Because you have to go <laughs> up them this way. If you try to go back down, it doesn't work. Uh, I know. So, I'm uh, <clears throat> looking over you, Resident Evil 2. <clears throat> Ew, God. But <laughs> luckily, we don't have to worry about that for a little while. Because this game does what the old school game didn't do. No random encounters. Yeah, that's the good part. Yes, what's also a good part is this freaking majestic bullshit. You want to know what they were doing with this? Uh, please. Why they are they were, wearing um, sneakers? Street art, dude. But, um, basically, <laughs> this was their way of saying, hey, we love Michael Jackson. We're gonna do the thriller dance. What? Uh-huh. What? What? I mean, uh, I, I guess I can Did see Did you notice it. they're doing the thriller dance? Yeah, I, I'm more just confused by the, the clothing choice, I think. Well, you know, it, it's not a Final Fantasy game without fucked up costumes. I mean, yeah, this was the, this, I think this is the second one Nomura did, so it certainly shows. <laughs> Come on, let's go! What are you waiting for? She might die! Doing my best Jake Marshall impression. Phoenix right. A guy faking he's a cowboy. Perfect for Irvine. Or Irvin or however. <laughs> Speaking of fakers, look at that guy! I know, what a fucking poser! Jeez Louise! Did he really need to go for the or ornamental stab wound? Or is that more of a... I think it's more of a slash wound. Whatever. Cyphers. What do you mean, ornamental slash wound? It had to be just like Squall's. Well, Squall did it to him. I mean... Well, Cypher did it first. I don't remember where Cypher got his. No. Cypher hit Squall. Yes. And that's how Squall got his. Squall turned right around and hit him back. That's how Cypher got one. Oh, so this, oh yeah, because this is the first, I think this is the first cutscene we actually get with Cypher alone. That's probably what it is. Um, mm -hmm. This is the first time you see him, like, really up close with that thing on his face. Speak but Squall basically gave him as good as he got. Yeah, I forgot something down here last time, because I was in such yeah. a, I was in such a hurry to get Renoa to fucking climb, I'm like... Well, climb down the sewers. Spe speaking of which, I've seen weird, like, I've seen weird ways of doing ladder climbs. I've seen the two arms in the middle, but then some people uh -huh. do the two arms on the outside, and I'm like, what are you doing? I think Renoa's one of the two arms on the outside people. Uh. I know you don't like her, and I know that you're a fucking total Quistus fan here, but jeez. I... I know. Cut her some slack. No, it's it's more that it's something I noticed because it wasn't just her. I've seen it. I've seen it elsewhere. Yeah, a couple of the characters in this game do it. I I, I, I wonder if I think Selfie does that too. I think so. Anyway, I don't need. I think it was a Weapons Monthly magazine that you yeah, picked was, up. Yeah, it was Weapons Monthly. I'm just making sure we got these set up because I missed Volume Three, but I can always get it back in a later part of the game mm -hmm. so instead of saving Renoa let's read a fucking magazine <laughs> well yeah because it's not like time is pressing or anything yeah it's weird how these games work which is funny because you never know like <clears throat> you never know like how much time passes in like a game or a movie or sometimes it's like a month long skip and it's like when did that happen that's exactly my point with how bad you are with Renoa. Like, I'm not going to spoil or anything here, but later on in the game, there's a tremendous time skip. 
And that's why, you know, some of what happens with Squall and Renoa's relationship doesn't make sense to you. Because it does do a time skip. To be fair, most of the games in the Final Fantasy PlayStation 1 era didn't really stick the landing. I've been a proponent of saying that Disc 2 is not all that great in Final Fantasy 7. And I'm probably the only one who thinks that because it's more revisionist history. I get what they were going for. But to be fair, Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy IX is just a fucking lore dump. We, we did that game so I can go ahead and say, the fuck was that? I'm just like, <laughs> what? Oh, Final what? Fantasy IX was like their uh, love letter to the fans of all the traditional Final Fantasy games that came before Seven. Yeah, and I can see it, it like, with all the shit they pulled and Terra. I was just like, no. I, I, I know, right? Speaking of things I don't understand, hello, dead guy. How you doing? Yeah, right? <clears throat> that, that turned out well. Can't go in there yet. Didn't it? We will go there. We gotta make sure. Um, make sure. Okay, I have. Make sure all your junctions are in place. Yes, and more importantly, I'm gonna keep that because I might. Yeah. Get, I might get screwed. I have battle speed down to some crazy low level, so I don't. I mean, I know I know the correct word is petrified, but you might get stoned too. Yes, I hate, <laughs> I hate these guys so much. Me too. Don't forget to. Uh... Yep. Get the cute little guy. Do not look up what a carbuncle is, viewers. N not Dumb. not not this carbuncle. If I I've seen what an actual carbuncle is, it's terrifying. So don't do it. Really? Yeah. It's some. Oh my god! Now you're making me want to go look it up. It's some sort of weird skin condition. Don't, don't do it. Um. Yeah. It's, don't. Or if you're going to do it off off camera. I but... did not. Look, I don't. I have not seen an image. But oh my god. Yeah. It's in a category with boils. Yeah, Ew. Yeah. So why why they would why they would name. To be fair, uh. it, start, it started in Final Fantasy V, so it, um, it started in Final Fantasy V, so... Oh, I'm going to petrify. God damn it. Okay, I'm going to type in something else. Okay, so... Oh, shit. Well, Squall's in a big bit of trouble. Okay, get it. Carbuncle. Um, a legendary species of small animal in South American folklore. Okay, that's what they were going for. In the, specifically in the mining folklore of northern Chile. Also, I hope, I, I, hope I don't die here. <laughs> the animal is said to contain riches of some sort. In some versions, it's a precious stone that gives fortune and good luck to its owner. Okay, that's the one they were looking for. Thank God. Cause... Yeah. Okay, that was a bad idea. Okay, if you're gonna Google search carbuncle, type in mythological carbuncle. Okay. All right. There you go. So I need to make absolutely sure I get this soft. Google off. is your friend if you give it the right direction. Yes. <laughs> Man, I do yeah. not. I don't. I don't want to use it. The problem is the magma breath causes that petrified bullshit. And did they die? Did they die? No, of course they didn't. Is, this has nothing to do with Final Fantasy, but one of my biggest pet peeves is people of my generation saying that they don't know how to do technology because they're from my generation. Bull fucking shit. If I can do it, you can do it. Pardon my French. It, that just that just grinds my gears. Okay, well, fire doesn't work. Now you know why I hate these guys. Hopefully, mm -hmm. yeah, now you, now you know the whole petrification sucks. Anyway, let's try something else. Shiva worked fine. You know what, screw it. Oh, you have Diablos already? Yep. Ooh, oh, wow, maybe. um, I could have just... I mean, I you could have just... try gravity attack, yeah. <laughs> 
or I could stab the guy. Sorry, Irvin, but uh, he's dead. <laughs> Lol. Yep. So they both dead. Yeah. We didn't even get to see Shiva's butt this time. I'm... I know that's why. You know what? That's why Shiva is so heavily used in Final Fantasy. Everybody wants to see her butt. Or her boobs. Or that, yeah. And, uh... Okay, now this is... This is one of those moments where everybody thinks that she's not being consistent, but she's really, like, every, even whatever she's come across, she's never come across a situation kind of like this. She was fucking terrified. Well, I mean, she was possessed and almost killed by lizard things. I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is one of the this is one of the things that kind of makes Squall melt a little bit. I guess. Oh, a woman touched me. Well, I mean, look at the you've got a cute girl grabbing on your arm and confessing how totally scared out of her mind she is. Makes you feel like big bad hero, you know? Whether he wants to be or not. Some guys get off on that. Just I guess. I'm just saying. It's over now. And then he just says the manliest thing ever. <laughs> yeah, it's over now. It's it's your line. No, the whole uh, oh, I was scared. Uh oh. I was really, really scared. <sighs> You're used to battles, aren't you? I I couldn't. I just couldn't. I mean, did you not see them jump at you? I, I mean. I couldn't fight alone. Look, even her dog can't help her in that situation, dumbass. You're not ready for all this. Wow, wait it, wait it. Dude, just knock her hand away. <laughs> okay, I, Squall is being a dick in this situation. I save her, and just, meh. It's like, wow. <laughs> Still not used to opening up to people yet. Uh, uh, I haven't forgotten your order. Let me go, you got cooties. <laughs> <laughs> Now this is just this is what he says. But like right there. Stay close to me. So you guys fighting or something? Cause I was seeing a guy not like a girl for some reason. You stupid fu I want him to smack squall so much. That was so mean. Yeah, you know what? Irvin would have went, I'm in love. He already Jackpot. tried. Yeah. But he didn't save her from train, a life remember? or death situation. Yeah, I know. Jesus, he hit on every single girl in the party on that train. <laughs> yep. Except Quista, she wouldn't have none of that shit. Um, Irvin Kitty. No, she told him to shut his ass up. <laughs> it's in your hands now. And he's just like, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. uh, uh. He's like, because I'm the urban cowboy. <laughs> yeah, and then we then we find out later. It's just like mm, I'm gonna sit against the wall. Why did he get all quiet? Oh, he must be concentrating. Well, yeah, because everybody who gets quiet is obviously concentrating. Lo loneliness of the sharpshooter. I guess he has a point. I can't hear anything. What's going on in the parade? A cipher. So he's alive? Mm. Renoa. Cipher's alive. He was in the parade with the sorceress. What does it mean? Who knows? If I were to face the sorceress directly, would I have to go. I love how they're making it seem like it's such a big deal and then it's totally not. I know. That's the way it goes, as a seed. You can't choose your enemies. I may end up killing him. Maybe it's for Renoa's sake. Maybe that's why he's being contemplated. Well, cause... yeah. He was the... Okay, Cypher was the first boy who ever actually paid attention to Renoa. You're both prepared, right? That's the kind of world you live in. You've had a lot of emotional training. But, of course, I'd rather it not happen. 
whatever that is. It's all up to Irvin. Uh, the huh. best one, the best one, it does that is from East uh, at all. His whole thing is at all explains the situation. It's like uh. he doesn't, he doesn't say anything. It's weird. Huh? I know, right? Is he freaking out? Yeah, he's, he's kind of like twerking. It's weird. Uh, don't tell me you're getting the jitters. Uh, I can't, I can't do it. Now you tell me. <coughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> Oh, oh my god, that was awesome! Uh, fucking. He's like, this is why I don't rely on people. All right. Well, let's see what we can do. Hopefully, I mean, with no no encounters, this shouldn't be too bad. Let's go yeah, ride. All you gotta do is just. All you gotta do is make sure you don't get lost. <laughs> well, climb the fucking. Oh, it's going the other way. Can't. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yep, let's knock over the ladders. It might it might lead to it. Uh nope. Is this any good? No one could draw! Uh, I don't wanna change now. Oh, while I'm not paying attention. Um Who has what? Two Everybody's gonna I mean, end up with everything anyway, but... Oh, you could just put Carbuncle on somebody in here just so you have the draw thing. I could. Oh yeah, duh. <laughs> For now. Alright. Yay! I love having a second person help me. Brains. Yes, brains are good. Except when you're getting eaten by the... You're... Because you're... of them. Yeah. <laughs> Brains. <laughs> also, if, if you've ever seen Carbuncle in Final Fantasy V, he is not cute at all. He will fucking murder your ass. I think he's borderline not cute in Final Fantasy IX either. Oh, no. He's totally he's totally cute. He's, he's nice and He's cuddly. more like... Okay, in Final Fantasy IX, he's more like that weird Pokemon they add every generation, you know? I guess. Kind of cute, it's the but kind of weird looking. It's it's the hair thing. He's like an alien, cute, furry thing. I don't know what it is. Uh, I know. Yeah, it, he he looks yeah. more like. In five, he looks more like a wolf. That's the crazy thing. Really? Yeah, he's in uh, one of the later dungeons as a secret boss, so you can grab him, and it's like, ah, fuck, because he's got okay. that auto reflection. Oh my god, you're right. Ew. <laughs> yeah. So they, they, yeah, they made him cute and cuddly <laughs> for a reason. Because you. Okay, yeah, Final Fantasy Nine. He, I just haven't seen Carbuncle in a while, but he does look really. It's it's just uh more elaborate. Yeah. Okay. He looks more like a Nine Tails. Quistus is probably just like, climb one of them, go up, and go down another one, and do the t Nobody likes this section, by the way. And I'm, am I screwed? No, because it's so damn easy to get lost in here. It's like, which way do I go? Okay, okay, good. Because I think the old Lo Like the old Looney, Co Looney Tunes cartoons. Which way did he go? Which way did he go? Where's the kaboom? That's I'm supposed too. to be a major kaboom. <laughs> I love that voice. I don't. I don't know why. Ever since I heard that, because I forgot what his voice sounded like. Speaking of voice acting, that guy did everything. It's like I think he's the only guy who ever. It's like he did all of the voices, if I remember right. He could do the entire damn cartoon by himself. <sighs> that is that is some crazy talent. He did it for like, wasn't it like forty years or something? Uh, yeah, and then you've got people like Frank Welker, who's like half of the voices in Scooby Doo. Like, yeah, he's just like, good lord. I'm a, I'm a wolf. I'm a dog. I'm Bronx from Gargoyles. I'm a thing. I'm a this. I'm a that. I'm everything. Mm-hmm. Also, finally freaking made it, and I'm trying to hit buttons. <laughs> Why am I hitting buttons? Um, I don't know. Why are you hitting buttons? What the hell did they do to you? I don't know. It's it's the thing. Anyway, um, <laughs> okay, so vitality. I think it really depends. Okay, so HP, vitality, and magic, and status defense. So who needs that? Um, I, 
think, yeah, Squall definitely needs it. Okay. Squall gets everything. Lucky bastard. Uh huh. 29, that's pretty good. I really need to get those higher, but I'll take it for now. All right, let's save and make absolutely damn sure that... Okay, okay she has items, so I don't need Irvin to have... All right, let's change that around and... You might want to... For everybody, like, if they have an extra ability slot, you might want to make sure that they've got another stat-boosting ability or something. Yeah, let me make sure. As you've got, like, Renoa only has HP plus 20. She's definitely, she's got GFs that have more stat boosting abilities. No, I haven't leveled up that much. If Freak has, okay, there's elements. Not gonna worry about that so much. I meant the regular abilities, you know, like when you're doing the draw magic and everything. Oh. Oh, yeah. Like, the, the passive abilities. Well, let's see what we got. Because, like, Squall's got a third thing. Um... Oh. Well, that helps. Uh -huh. Now Urban won't get punched. And Renoa had an empty slot, too. I don't know what else... I don't know what she's got. Okay. Oh, she just has HP plus 20. Jeez, no wonder. Alright, All right, let me save absolutely sure. Good, we're at the Dayling City Gateway. So, we'll call it here for today, and it'll be the end of Disc 1. Hooray! See you guys next time. Woo!